Deborah Meaden, the queen of Ramona's rejoiners and the metropolitan hackney types. She, just because she has a lot of talent to grow businesses and make a lot of money, she thinks that she has the right to tell us what to do with our lives. She thinks she's smart enough to know about everyday common sense politics. She came on Twitter to essentially, indirectly, defend China and China's method in governance. Initially, she tweeted about the cost of living crisis, saying, I don't think our government has a clue about what this cost of living crisis means for most people. I agree, Deborah. Spot on. And I thought, well, this could be interesting, Tread. But I continue reading the rest of the tweets, and unfortunately, things went down. She said, and why would our economy be performing worse than those countries with far more draconian lockdown rules? Specifically, at this point, we are talking about China, New Zealand, Canada. And there are obviously a number of people, uh, countries that keep going up and down in terms of the measures. Uh, but uh, right now, China is the worst when it comes to lockdown rules and all these restrictions. Someone replied to this tweet simply saying, uh, it isn't. Our country is not doing worse than those countries. And she said, really? China. How about China? <laughs> Let's be more like China. <laughs> in the words of Donald Trump, China. But is she right? Of course, she's not right. She's never right about anything apart from how to grow a business. As I said, that's a good talent. Well done, Deborah. This is the same China that, yes, they made a lot of money, but right now they're going down. There's a lot of issues right now facing the Chinese economy. Uh, for, for example, they've actually decided as a strategy to put prosperity on hold. I love how they have the power in China to be like Thanos in, in Marvel, to actually like pause stuff. Yeah, how can you pause prosperity? Clearly, they have the power to do that because they, they have other problems to deal with. So essentially, cost of living crisis is going to get even worse in Beijing than in London. This is the same China that, yes, they made money initially compared to us because they were the ones who leaked. They, they did the cover up. Then they sold us PPE. The, the, the face masks and, you know, the testing kits and everything else came from China. Some of them came from Wuhan. So you wonder why. China was the only country in 2020 and 2021 that made money compared to any other normal economy. That's why they cheated. It's not normal country. It's just not <laughs> the whole gang in the CCP. They don't really care about cost of living. They don't really care about ordinary people in China being in poverty. You work hard for the flag, for the state, for President Xi. As I said, prosperity is on hold. They also have other crises that they're dealing with. Fewer marriages, fewer children. China's crisis is now getting from bad to worse because all the, the workforce are actually getting older and older. A lot of people are actually losing their lives. And within the next few decades, if they don't sort out this problem that they created, by the way, do you remember a few years ago when they, they had restrictions on how many babies you could have? Well, that backfired massively. Don't think that the CCP, I'll call it CCPism instead of communism at this point, because China is run on national socialism. It's no longer a communism. It's not a good idea. It doesn't work. The West is not perfect. The Western model economically is not perfect. I'm very, a massive critic of a lot of stuff that we do, including central banking. But at least it's not national socialism. And all right now, with all the, I'm sure you've seen the videos and the images from across China, uh, that they are putting people in queues for hours every single day and every morning before you get to work because you have to get tested. Uh, they also have this policy now you have to actually be <laughs> sitting on the floor because <laughs> clearly the virus doesn't get up there. So yeah, if you actually, the people who are actually doing the test, they have to be on top of you. So it's, it's a weird situation right now. So they think, people like Deborah Meaden, that we should be more like China. No, do not be more like China. Be a capitalist and be a normal not a complete globalist, just have some common sense. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. I'm my TCN, we are the media.